Thing. Promotional consideration furnished by the following. Welcome back. We have a secret square up there worth just under $10,000. And Brad, I believe it's your turn. Rita Moreno for the block, All please. All right, for the block, she plays uh, Caroline Novak on The Guardian on CBS. Rita, in Indian tribes, who was the most important man in the tribe, the low man on the totem pole or the high man on the totem pole? Well, the obvious one seems to be the high man on the totem pole, but that makes me think that it's probably the low man on the totem pole. It's up to you, Brad. I will disagree. It's the uh, low man on the totem pole. Can't give you that one, Cynthia. Rita Moreno for the win. And a tie game. All right. All right. Parade Magazine found 80% of people surveyed would like our country's national anthem changed from the Star Spangled Banner to what song? America the Beautiful. I agree. That is it. Oh, yes, Circle. Yes, it. Martin Moe was our secret square. Nobody picked Martin. Our secret square tomorrow will be worth over $14,000. Tiebreaker game now is worth two grand. And Cynthia, you kick it off. Brad Garrett, please. All right, Brad. <laughs> Brad, imagine this now. When you become a nun, yes. you take three vows. Poverty and chastity are two. What's the third? Not to give away the ending of the Bible. Charity, maybe. I agree. Obedience. X gets the square. Brad? I'll take Martin Mull, please. Martin Mull. All right, Martin. Thank you. The, the Beckman Research Institute says this makes some male fruit flies gay. What? <laughs> oh, jeez. <clears throat> Well, I, I would think years and years and years of being called fruit fly was starting to... <laughs> you know, that would start to take its toll after a while. And then finally, you just say, all right, fine, fine, fine fruit fly. Just quit saying that. Uh, <laughs> I, I think uh, that and, uh, and heat. Actually, just uh, heat. Heat. I will agree. Uh, yeah, when it gets above 86 degrees, mutant males try to mate with other males. Woohoo! All right, yeah. X gets that one. Cynthia. John Ritter for the block. John for the block, all right. John, a, uh, an old Japanese proverb says, you are a fool if you don't climb it, but you are a bigger fool if you climb it twice. Climb what? That would be Anna Nicole Smith. Only kidding. <laughs> oh, oh, Anna. Anna and I go way back. I can kid. Uh, Mount Fuji. Uh, Mount Fuji. I agree. Yes, Mount Fuji. Circle gets it. Brad. Dom DeLuise, please. Dom DeLuise. All right, Dom. Here we go. True or false, a person can be nominated for two Best Actor Oscars in the same year. I think that's false. But don't get me wrong. I just got him a few minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> um, I will agree. Yeah, it's false. They're no longer allowed to be nominated oh. more than once in a category. X gets the square there. Cynthia? Warren's out for the block. Warren for the block. Arrow Warren <laughs> from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Warren, which bra was auctioned off for more money, one signed by the Canadian women's hockey team or a bra signed by Celine Dion? Ooh. <laughs> Do I get a uh, bid in this thing with Celine Dion? <laughs> <laughs> I'd have to go with Celine Dion. I agree. No. The oh. one signed by the hockey team. Can't give you that one, Brad. Uh, Sue Murphy for the win, please. Sue Murphy for the win. Oh, and $2,000. So in the Hans Christian Andersen tale, what did the emperor wear that shocked the commoners? Wait, what were the... It's, it's in the, um... Uh, no, I think it, it was nude, isn't it? Uh, they were naked. He wasn't wearing anything. Uh, I will agree. He was wearing naked. He was nothing. Actually, nude, naked. Buckus. <laughs> and the win for another $2,000. We are out of time. Cynthia, we're going to give you $1,000 for today, but you leave us with a total of $37,271. Pleasure having you here. Dad, you got three grand. You're our new champion.
Wang. Congratulations. You're going to get a chance to win the car that Cynthia won yesterday in our bonus round right after this. Stick around. here, uh, won $3,000 in our front game, and now we look at these nine keys over here, Brad, because one of them will start what, Jeffrey? It's the new Toyota MR2 Spider. Get behind the wheel of the Toyota MR2 Spider, and your sitting heart rate goes up. Get the feeling. Toyota, worth $24,771. We've uh, found out a little bit about what the stars know. Here's where we find out how much you know about them. You pick a square. I'll read a statement about that star. If you agree or disagree correctly, you've won the square. At the end of 30 seconds, for every square you've won, we take away a bad key. All right? 30 seconds on the clock for our new champ. It starts ticking when you pick your first star. Kathy. Kathy once banked Howard Stern on the air. Agree. Wrong. Next. Warren. Warren named his daughter after a car. Agree. Wrong. Next. John. John narrated true Hollywood story on Rue McClanahan. Agree. Right. Next. Deborah. Deborah sold monkey chow at a farm supply store. Disagree. Wrong. Next. Brad. Brad did a voice in an extremely goofy movie. Agree. Right. Next. Rita. Is the godmother of Jennifer Love Hewitt. Agree. Wrong. Next. Martin Mall. His songwriting credits include ventriloquist love. Agree. Right. Next. Dom. Played Clemenza in The Godfather 2. Agree. Wrong. Next. Sue. Was once a regional manager of Taco Bell. Agree. Nope. All right. Let's go down and count some keys here, Brad. Here we go. All right, get your key karma out here. You got three right in 30 seconds. Let's take away three of the bad ones. All right, one of those six will do it. Let's go for the middle. All right, dead center. Good luck. Come oh, on, I need this car. <laughs> <laughs> really want this car. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, come on out, Brad. Let's take a look at which key would have started the car. Right up here. Right up here. All right, now, good news is for each correct answer, you get $1,000. I'll turn over here so they can see you at home. There you go, right over here. So we'll add $3,000 to your total. Day one, uh, as champ, you get $6,000. You get back here tomorrow, we'll start with eight keys. All right, so good luck. Thank you very much. Brad will be back as our center square. So will all our stars. I'm Tom Berger. I'm hoping you join us, too. Hollywood Square. Bye-bye. This is Jeffrey Tambor, the voice of Hollywood Square, saying so long. Promotional consideration furnished by the following. <laughs> My wallet! My wallet! Okay. Oh, wow. It's amazing. You want to give some of the podium? Sure, sure. How far? Oh, yeah, yeah. Like he can't push me out of the way. Yeah. Well, that six foot eight Jew, that's a tough guy there. My eye! Okay. What's up? Three, two. Join me and my main man, Brian Garrett. Oh, Brad Garrett. You got me, bro. You got I couldn't help it. That was too easy.